welcome to Police TV, this balmy, balmy, balmy uh, Wednesday evening here in sunny Bretford, as it is across the whole country, I do believe. And you find me outside our deliciously and delightfully painted, repainted police bar, along with our wonderfully progressing bordering. And we're putting lots of work into getting the place looking nice and swish for you, as well as lots of safety features, hence the gun, which arrived today. And uh, that allows us to test our staff when they come in for their shifts to make sure they're all uh, within the temperature range, you know, don't you know? But uh, yes, yeah, so welcome. Um, now, uh, and the dog. And the dog. Oh yeah, the dog. The dog, like, was pretty, yeah, cold. Apparently. Um, so, uh, a very compact and busy night for you this evening because we've been busy reading up on all the new regs. Lots of very interesting stuff to get into our bounces and make sure that we uh, enact on your behalf and ours. So, um, what we're going to do first, we're going to just have a very briefest of uh, chats with our chef. I'm stood outside the world-famous police pizza hut with our esteemed chef, Carlos Menzies. Hello. Uh, Carlos, thanks for joining us That's tonight. No problem. Um, I just wanted to ask you a few things. First of all, we've, we've been doing the um, um, takeaway food for quite yeah. a while, haven't we? What do you yeah. think has been the greatest success with that? Uh, probably pizza and Sunday roast, probably. Uh, like the locals are really supporting us on a Friday night then throughout the weekend but Sunday race been really popular as well and going forward we're we're going to continue the um, takeaways yeah. the takeaways yeah. what do you think what do you think about that I think it's really good it just proves that there's a market for it even though we've been in lockdown I just think sometimes people are going to be a bit nervous about coming out maybe in the near future and they might continue to have takeaways and stuff yeah that's a good point actually yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. do you prefer working in that kitchen or in there in yeah. here, <laughs> it's a little bit cooler. It's, it's hot today. <laughs> <laughs> it's very hot today. So yeah. So anybody who hadn't ordered a pizza, now's your chance. Yeah. Yeah. But um, thanks, Carlos, for no joining problem. us. And uh, I know you've got to do some cooking in the mouth. So thanks right, nice very one. much. Thank Cheers. you. Cool. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Now here is a lovely quartz tankard, which is hung in the ceiling of the our beloved pizza room. Victorian, uh, but I'm drinking from this beauty, which has a certain provenance. It's the first ever festival tankard owned by herself, our technical director. So cheers to you, Tash, and your lovely tankard. Sadly, of course, uh, when we get reopened, people won't be able to have their tankards or their glasses refilled. We'll have to give clean receptacles at all times. But there we go. So I thought I would finish our um, wondrous evening with a song. But first, it's Julian's joke. I've just had a decorator in to do some work. I got chatting to him and it turns out he is a British Airways pilot who's been furloughed and earning a bit of extra cash. He made a lovely job of the landing. So there we go. A short little show for you tonight, but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless um, so here we go here's a song that I learned some time ago and I've been known to sing in the old folk festival session etc and in the pewter um, so. when I was a young man my father did say when summer is coming it's time to make hay and when hay is carted, don't you ever fail to drink master's health in a pint of good ale. Ale, ale, glorious ale, served up in pewter, it tells its own tale. Some folks likes radishes, some curl like kale. But give I boil partnip, parsnips and a girt dish of taters and a lump of fatty bacon and a pint of good ale. Our MPs in Parliament are faithful to keep 
I hope now we put him there, he won't go to sleep. But he'll always get my vote if he'll never fail to keep taxes down on a pint of good ale. Ale, ale, glorious ale. Served up in pewter, it tells its own tale. Some folks likes radishes, some curl I kale. Forgive I boil parsnips and a girt this shit taste and a lump of fatty bacon and a pint of good ale. Some folks is teetotalers, they drink water neat. They must rot their guts and give them damned feet. But I know a man, he will never grow stale on boiled beans and bacon and a pint of good ale. Ale, ale, glorious ale. Served up in pewter, it tells its own tale. Some folks likes radishes, some curl like kale, but give I boil parsnips and a good dish of potatoes and a lump of fatty bacon and a pint of good ale. Good night from Police TV.